California has one of the highest rates of pedestrian vehicle accidents in the United States. Because of this, citizens have decided to take matters into their own hands by teaching others about the importance of motor and pedestrian safety. One of these citizens, Damian Kevitt, a victim who was involved in a hit and run case while biking in Griffith Park, decided to start Streets Are For Everyone. Streets Are For Everyone is a nonprofit that works on road safety for all road users. So we work on legislation. Uh, getting bills passed in Sacramento that would make roads safer, that help encourage safer driving behaviors. We also do victim support services. So we help victims of traffic violence get back on their feet after they've lost or after they've been hit or if they've lost a loved one to help them get back on their feet. While many people come for the medals at the end of the race, one longtime participant attends to show that even while paralyzed, he still has what it takes to finish the ride. I learned to ride a skateboard on my knees. I got a spinal cord injury. I was stabbed in the back and my spinal cord was cut. I used to be a cross country runner. So once I figured out how to skateboard, I seen how much cardio it takes and I started riding my board like a couple miles a day just for cardio. But Jesse isn't alone in his skating adventures. In many cases, he is accompanied by his partner in crime, Rose. I brought my dog this time just because I was supposed to join the puppy run, but I thought the puppy run was in grass. So I signed up for the 5K with her. She's done a 5K before with me. She's been on Animal Planet. She's done a lot of runs with me. And although Jesse wasn't impaired due to a pedestrian vehicle accident, he has the same message that everyone in attendance was trying to convey. To keep Santa Clarita safe, be mindful of others on the road. Xander Grable, reporting for Canyons News.